No, this was uh, Harry and Meghan's first dance on Saturday night, Ray. What was yours? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I knew you say that. Um, I can't remember, Al. I really can't remember. It's a lot quite a while. When did I get married? 98, I think I got married, don't I? So, what was yours, Al? Uh, Barry White. Was it? Uh, can't, can't who who, who picked that? You love me, of course, me. No, you've got to get... Got, the young lady's got to pick. Your Mrs. Brazil's got to pick the I first time. I can't remember. You haven't a laugh. I've just made that up. <laughs> you heard me there, Barry White. <laughs> I can't remember either. Um, yeah. Uh, well, that's a quite a good one. First dance, isn't it? Uh, a, st- a staff studded cast rock tops in George's Chapel wins on Saturday. Harry tied the knot, of course, <laughs> and Meghan became the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Biggest names showing up included Beckham, Oprah Winfrey, Tom Hardy, Elton John. Uh, oh, Tom Hardy, of course. Stephen Knight joined us a little bit later. Uh, uses Tom a lot. Uh, Ray, who's the most famous person at your wedding? Uh, I, don't, I don't think I invited any of the players. No? Uh, no, I've, I just had all my, oh, all my mates, I'd, really. I'd, 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 the whole, I'd the whole club of mine. Did you have? Did you have yeah, well, the, whole club. the most famous one would have been Sir Bobby, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm sure. No, I, I, I kept a really small wedding. Um, he loved it. He said to me he was, he was last to leave because the snow came down. Did you, you get married in the church? Uh, church and then back to oh, I got a, registry a big office. hotel. And uh, the snow came down and it was literally, yeah. this is the last car leaving. You either stay the night or go. And he, said, he looked at me and he said, um, son, what a wedding. Um, the only thing missing is Frank Sinatra, he said. Brilliant. Yeah. And off he went. Oh, right. The car yeah. went without me, came back in, off came the hat, off came the scarf. Hmm. And he hit the dance floor. Yeah. yeah another Brilliant. name on Saturday's guest list was England and Wash star James Haskell. And our very own Lawrence Delalio, not happy, accepted the invite. So James had a foot injury, keeping him out of the premiership at the semi-final. So rather than supporting his teammates, he rocked up at Windsor. Alonis criticised him, saying it would be poor form, really, wouldn't it? He should be here with his teammates. I'm sure Harry wouldn't mind. He loves his rugby anyway. So, Ray, has he done anything wrong? Would you have missed the final game of the season for the wedding? It was a semi-final. Yeah, I, I think I would have been at the game, Al. I, I know look, it's, it's a, it's a once-in-a-lifetime to go to a, a royal wedding, but... I think it's, you know, you're, all your teammates. Uh, under under, you, my, under be, my thumb as his girlfriend. If I'm, if I'm, say we're in a semi-final of the FA Cup and there's a wedding going on. You know, you, I'm going to be at the game. Even though you can't play, uh, you've got to support your teammates, surely. So I'm, I'm, I'm with Lawrence on that. He definitely. really was angry by all accounts. You know and what? they got hammered, didn't they? Well, I don't blame him. I mean, you've got to, you've got to support your teammates. Uh, yeah, and I'm sure that if, they, if he had mentioned, said, look, I've got a big game the weekend, thanks for the invite. I, I, don't think they, I think his contract was up. They've not offered him a new one. Though. Oh, right. I, look, I don't know the politics of why, why uh, you know, if it's just to do with contracts or whatever, but I still think they're your teammates still, and, and you've gone a long way in that season to get to the semi-final. I know they got hammered in the end. But he still should be there mm. for me. By the way, if I'm being dead honest, I didn't watch What would you do, Al? Uh, me? I think you would have gone to the wedding, wouldn't no, you? No, no, no. No, no. I think I'd have been at the club. Free booze, you would have been. No, right no, no, no. You would have been. No, I'd have been I, at the I'm club. I'm sure it's a pretty good wine as well that was drinking now. Yeah, but you get one you get one glass every four hours. What? You get drinks tokens? They don't, I don't think they have drink tokens at the year world wedding. No, no, now. no. You've got to behave yourself, haven't you? You can't keep going up for a refill. No. Of course you can. No, you can't. You can. No, the man, the, the man making all the headlines is this Michael Curry. President Bishop of the, what is it, Episcopal Church, hit the headlines for his rousing sermon at the Royal Wedding. Controlled fire in that plane got me here. Fire makes it possible for us to text and tweet and email and Instagram and, and Facebook and socially be dysfunctional with each other. Fire. 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 Hallelujah, bro. Uh, but fire and love weren't the only things Bishop Curry mentioned, Ray. Uh, I'm going to play you two clips from his sermon, and I want you to identify the meaning behind these words what? and whether it's sound advice for the happy couple. So here's your first clip from Bishop Michael Curry. Imagine this tired old world when love is, is the way, when, when love is the way, unselfish, sacrificial, redemptive, when love is the way, then no child will go to bed hungry in this world ever again. What? Well, uh, right, what it, message is uh, Michael Curry giving Meghan and Harry here? Could you have offered better advice? Uh, not, what, than that? Hmm. I think he's, he's all about himself, isn't it? And this, you know, he's... Careful. What, what, Careful. Would, I, what, would, I, what, what would I say? Um, what, advice? What, what, that, what he was trying yeah. to explain to him now? I don't know. 
what do you, do you, what do you make of that? He said, love, uh, with love, no kid and, go hungry. I, I, look, you can get very political here, can't you? I don't really want to, but I don't really see what, I, I what don't that's got to do with Meghan and Harry. Anyway, uh, what about the, can you <laughs> identify the hidden message in this one? What was the hidden now, message the in the other one? Is demonstrated by the fact that we're all here. Two young people fell in love and we all showed up. But, but it's not just for and about a young couple who we rejoice with. It's more than that. Right. right. Oh, what was the, What's what was more? The, Can we hear more? What's more than yeah, that? But, yeah, but what, what, was the, what was the message in the first one? First one, I think we try to get love. You know, we should be better people in this world and kids would... would uh, kids would not be going to bed hungry at night, so we mm. we should be looking after each other better. I think that was it. Sticking much. together more, yeah. Yeah, well, mm. you, know, uh, you don't have ten kids if you've no money, do you? No. Right. Okay. So, so what was the second message? I've no idea. <laughs> I've really no idea. Uh, you sure? Well, so go then. What do you, what do you no, know? No, I'm I'm a bit, little bit snookered myself, Al. <laughs> <I don't, laughs> I'm a, I'm a little bit. Uh, uh, yeah, I didn't. I didn't really. Did you watch it? I didn't weekend? know. No, no I, I, I can't. I saw the bit when they come when she came in with the her, wife. Watched she had a beautiful it. dress. She watched it. Yeah, she watched it. I, Are you into the Royals, Al? Do you think? Um, I'm respectful, but you know, I think it was great when he walked in with his brother. Uh, that long walk into the. Uh, he looked really nervous, though, didn't he, Harry? Mm. He, he looked like he, he he just wanted a, a normal. And I think he did have a normal, as normal as it could be, being at Windsor. He could have been a lot more bigger, Al, couldn't it? I tell you um, what I will say, and I don't he's care. A good, I think he's a really good one. That's just come out of the... Uh... No, 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 I don't. I remember that very well. Mm. I was working for Sky at the time. We were at Crew, and the, the news came through. And I've heard so many different what happened. And it's a shame about her dad couldn't be there, wasn't it? He couldn't be there. <laughs> oh, my dad, my dad. 